What are they doing? Play. Overgrown wains, you see. Have you any children, Geralt? None. Oh, yes. Forgot witches are sterile. Well, don't just stare at me. Tell me what brings you. Vladimir sends his love. You spoke to him. Impossible. Did more than that. Fulfilled your wish. And talked to him extensively. Curious what he had to say? Fulfilled your wish. Your dead brother had himself one more day like those of old. Very easy to say. But have you got any proof? I do. Vladimir's hand is unmistakable. You've done well, Witcher. Is that all? Or have you something else? Gonna work on getting you Bersodi's house next. Best of luck. Enjoy. Janine Shukin Wanker. The devil warned me. This the Brasodi Brothers auction house? Seems it. Private Kleiner, you're on duty. Need I remind you, fraternizing with civilians is not allowed. Purpose of your visit? Any of the owners home? Meaning the one and sole owner, the esteemed host Besodi? Aye, he is. Need to talk to him. Order 76 CWX is clear. Auctions only open to folk with invitations. Writ out in their names, plain and simple. Gonna let that hold you back? Come on. Afraid you're out of luck. Order 76 CWX also held that Lance Corporal Vatslav stick a broomstick up his ass. Kleiner, need I remind you of the penalty for insulting a superior? Who have we here? Geralt, the Witcher of Rivia. Vimy Vivaldi, the banker from... Actually, where are you from? Matters little, mate. Gold knows no boundaries. What's all the fash, Corporal Václav? Are you squabbling with my pal Geralt? Master Vivaldi, sir, your esteemed associate, he weren't invited to the auction, and I've... But I plough and have been, and he's coming with me. In you go, Geralt. But my orders... Fuck your orders! Need I take this up with the sergeant? Ha! A thought not. No! Stand to attention! And shut your giggy! Oh, the lads will be rolling back in the barracks. Sort it! Now march! Round you go! One, two, one, two! Appreciate the help. Just night! Always had a mind to see into old pals and clients. Business with you's a pure pleasure, Vimy. The dear departed wifey claimed the same. Ah ha! Folk are assembling. Auction's about to start. Time we went upstairs. Actually, I'm really just here to talk to Horst Borsodi. Oh, might be more of a problem than you'd expect. Because? An awful hermit, that one. Not a wee bit like his da, my little I keep his soul. But, Horst did like to show his feed during the auction. I'll introduce you then. Be mighty indebted to you. Think nothing of it. Only ever clicked on loans and promissory notes. <laughs> All right, up we go. Oh, shit. Egg, white 
gold and mother of Get out! Care, you thought of buying real estate? Could get to attractive terms on a mortgage. No such thing as attractive loan oh. terms, Vimy. Hmm. Auction won't start for a time yet, it seems. Vimy, this is a banquet. Aye? And? I detest banquets. Vacuous conversation, food portions fit for a mouse, drinks that taste like piss. Ah, it won't all be bad. Let me introduce you to some of my most interesting associates. Old hand there is Countess Mignol. Wager you'll have plenty to blather about with her. <laughs> Prick in the corner's Hilbert. New coin, that one. Came into a right fortune playing quite. Ah, there's Yaramir, art dealer. A purer snob I've never known. But he knows paintings like no other. So, ready to chat someone up? It's not fitting for us to stand here like knobs. <sighs> Oh, smell it, Geralt. That's the scent of coin. Greetings to the Honourable Countess. Madam, allow me to introduce my dear friend, Geralt of Rivia. Witcher of the School of the Wolf. Forgive me, but have we had the pleasure? No, but your guild is unmistakable. Your medallion. Take note, Geralt. Countess Mignol is an eminent collector of Vitaminaica. Vitamin. What now? All manner of objects related to the witcherly profession. Swords, gear, medallions. Does the Countess have her eye on anything particular today? No, but Horst Borsodi insisted he would put up something that would be of interest. Did he happen to say what it was? No. Oh, you know what he's like. A walking enigma. On another topic. Master Geralt, I was wondering if you'd be willing to help a lady in need. Depends on the nature of the need. Oh, it's quite the trifle. I stepped out onto the balcony a moment ago. I dropped an earring while there. I couldn't find it. It must have fallen through the floorboards. Perhaps you, with your cat eyes... Not a problem. I'll go right away. I shall be much obliged. See you in a minute, Vimy. Some spilled wine. Nothing else. Hmm. There's no earring out here, is there? None. Maybe the Countess would care to explain what this is about, all jokes aside. Forgive me. I... God, this is so embarrassing. Do... Do you know Vesemir? He was a tin shorter than you, wore a mustache. Do I know him? Man taught me everything I know. What? How is he, if you don't mind my asking? <sighs> Afraid I have bad news. Oh? Please tell me. Did he at least die like a witcher? No. He died like a hero. There is that. I thank you for tolerating a decrepit madwoman so elegantly. Please don't say that. I am old and I am wealthy. I may say what I please. And now, be so kind and leave me to my thoughts. Perhaps free. Funny. A decorative sword. You claim it by claiming it. Bankruptcy. That's, That's right. right. Hellbert! It's been years. Allow me to introduce you. Geralt of Rivia. Enchanted. Pleasure's all mine. How's it? Got your eye on any sparkly bits today? Not really. I buy what strikes me fancy. 
I need something right sumptuous for me walls just now. Nilfgaard. I get it right? Excuse me? Your Gwent deck. It's Nilfgaard, innit? Come on, admit it. Not a bad deck, Nilfgaard, but I'll take the Northern Realms over it any day. Ah, understood. A patriot. You ought to know, Helmut. Geralt here is a positively superb player. Superb! Hmm. We got a minute before the auction starts, so... Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Maybe around? Sorry. Another time, maybe. Hmm. It is what it is. I'm off for a nosh. By the by, watch those little black balls. Strange, them. Ah! To span the caviar of the Kaviri Sturgeon. They're casting pearls before swine. Come, Geralt. Let's have a blather with another. Vivaldi. Perusing the room. Yaramir! Might we trouble you, we spare? Mm hmm. Greetings, Vivaldi. Who's this? Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. I thought you might have a blather with us. About the paintings on the block today. Hmm? Ah, sniffing for a quick turnaround as usual, are we? Pot calling the kettle black, I'd say. Do a lively trade in canvases yourself, my friend. True. Yet first, they delight my eyes. Whereas you treat them as mere promissory notes. The only arts that interest you are those culinary. What about you, Witcher? Do you know anything about paintings? Realize this might be hard to believe, given my crude-looking mug. But yeah, I know a thing or two. Truly? We ought to see what. Do you know our friend Vivaldi is in possession of five canvases by van der Nobe? Yet he cannot distinguish them from landscapes at five crowns apiece. I shan't pretend it's otherwise. Yet for you, my dear connoisseur Witcher, that should present not the slightest problem, so do tell which of these is the handiwork of Edward van der Nobe, the master from Maribor. Really? Merchant with the pearl. No two ways about it. My, my. Who would have thought? Hmm. Might I have a word in private? Forgive me my impertinence. At first, I thought you an ignoramus. Vivaldi's equal. I feel I should apologize in the tone, so I shall tell you a secret. A Van Roo is due to appear on the block. The painter's unknown largely, but has a fierce admirer in Marcus Hodgson, a bookseller, has his shop in Novigrad's main square. I wager you'll sell him the canvas at a tidy profit. Thanks. Oh, think nothing of it. Now, please excuse me. My friends Becky. So, what did he tell you? Uh, nothing special. Truly? Huh. Shame that. Alright, let's go. Ink spot upon ink spot. She a number of them's doing my heed in. Huh. Esteemed ladies, honorable gentlemen. The auction will begin shortly. Take your places, please. Ah, at long last. Come with me to the fort. I won't see much elsewhere. I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. Vimy, listen. Forgot to ask you, how's this auction going to work? They'll bring out three lots to start with. Once they've sold, or not, there'll be an intermission. Horst Basodi will probably appear then. That's when I'll introduce you. 
counting on it. In the meantime, have you got a budget? You prepared to bid? Monster hunting doesn't pay all that well. Think I'll let you wealthy folk play. I'll wait in the back. Oh, Geralt, you and your sagging coin pouch. A financial advisor, that's what you need. Finances, that's actually what I'm lacking. Don't worry about me, go. I'll see if there's any caviar left. Esteemed ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. I hereby open the auction. Lot number one. 500 going twice, going thrice, sold! Do I see 300? Who will give me three? Ah, 300 from the monocled gentleman. I congratulate you on your successful acquisitions and invite you to partake of the refreshments during the intermission. So, how goes it, Garrett? Didn't I find it arcsome, my hope? Of course I did, as always with sophisticated company. But it was about what I expected, so... Oh, Geralt! Look! Horst Basudi! Come on, afore some other cocksuckers steal him! Just... Well, don't expect a warm welcome. Greetings, Horst. Allow me to introduce a dear friend and associate, Geralt of Rivia, who comes uninvited. Forgot my manners. Forgive me. The teaching at Kaer Morin, well, etiquette wasn't high on the list. Scandalous. Hmm. That's plain to see. <laughs> Got the distinct impression the two of you started off on the wrong foot. Perhaps we should raise a toast to... What's one like you want from one like me? Right, let's dispense with the niceties. Maximilian Borsotti's house. Gotta lay my hands on it, whatever it... What? Where did you learn of it? Gentlemen, no reason to lose our composure. Raise our voices. <laughs> I ask you, where did you learn of it? Whoa, come on now. Where? Doesn't matter. Willing to tell me what it is or not. Guards, escort the Witcher out. And he's not to enter, not alone, not hand in hand with Hierarch Hamelfart. Honestly, he asked a question. It were a simple inquiry. One more word, and I shall move my accounts to the competition. Sorry, mate, but... No reason to trouble the guards, Horst. I'll go willingly. I don't recall giving you a choice in the matter. Kick his swiving mutated ass out. Your swords, Master. Law says we're to return them. Law don't say when, though. So we'll do it, aye. Just after we beat the singing shite out of the honorable gentleman. Mm-hmm. Gathering place for the elite, truly. Come on, lads. Let's loosen our muscles a bit. Oh, those pops go, see? Uh, damn it. Law says if you see someone hurt, you should summon a medic. Law doesn't say how fast, though. So you can sit tight a while. Seems true what they say. Sword or no sword, a witcher brings gold. 
Not in the mood for your peasant wisdom. Who the hell are you? If all goes well, dare say I'm your partner. Don't need any partners. Oh, I don't know about that. No chance you'll lay your hands on Max Bosodi's house alone. Hmm. How do you know I was looking for the house? I was at the auction. Disguised, of course. That argument on the topic was hard to miss. Get to the point, if you can. To get this house, you need to get into the vault. And there's no way Horst will let you in there out of the kindness of his heart. A heist? Don't like that idea one bit. Got any others? Find the herbalist lives near Oxenfurt. Ask for some yarrow extract. You'll know why you've come. If this is a trap of some sort. Be seeing you. I hope. Rather efficient. That all you got to say? I saved your life. Pfft. We'd have disposed of that rabble easily. We? My, aren't we precise? You know what I mean. Now, are you here to trade or not, hmm? Know any advanced formulae? Maybe something you could teach me? All I know, I learned from Master Gremist of Skellige. Looking to apprentice yourself in the herbalist trade? Nah, I just want to learn something new. Call it what you will. You must sail across the Great Sea 
Find the Isle of Ard Skellig. There, in the sacred grove, the learned Master Gremist will judge whether you're fit to be his pupil. Wouldn't happen to have some yarrow extract? I do. In the back. Follow me, please. Come. Remains to be seen. Aim to tell me something, I think. So talk. How do I put this? We share a goal. We both need to get into the boss orders, but both want something that's in there. Why not pool our strengths? Sorry, but what exactly is yours? I have a plan. Spent the last year working on it. On paper. Time to set it in motion. You one I can count on. I'm not a thief. It's opportunity makes the thief, Witcher. I speak from experience. <sighs> Talk. Twenty Redanian soldiers guard the ocean house, day and night. Patrols walk in circles around it, and here, past this corner, barracks. Brute force is out. Gotta get in quietly. Exactly. Not the simplest thing, though. Main entrance, armored door. Windows, Dimeridian bar, but not a fortress out there without a weakness. This one's no different. Patience happens to be my weakness, so dispense with the dramatic pauses and talk. <clears throat> Beside the house stands a tower from which we can enter the attic. We can't hope to enter the tower from the street on account of the patrols, but there's a window 60 feet off the ground. No shutters, no bars. We've got to get up there and sneak across to the auction house, then down the stairs to the cellar, crack open or blow off the vault door, and voila! Not all bad, except sounds like a lot of work for two. I'm fully aware of that. For this to work, we need two more accomplices. One to scale the tower, drop us a line. The other to open the vault, a safe cracker, or a demolition specialty. I've already identified some promising candidates. All we have to do is select and recruit the best among them. Also your job. I'd uh, prefer to remain largely out of sight. Mm -hmm. Assumed as much given your hood. Anything else? I. Well, that's among the details, which you will learn just as soon as you declare. <sighs> Don't really have any other options. So be it. I'm in. But on one condition, no one dies. That clear? As the great son of Nilfgaard. How about we knock back around? Talk some mutually beneficial relationship. I'd rather get to work. What comes first? First, you have to assemble a crew. Then, there's the Redanian patrols to cull a bit. Too many wandering around. We could get them. Break in, artists. Tell me about them. Assuming lack of vertigo to be the first requirement. Precisely why my favorite Eveline Gallo. A circus artist no better is than the Earl. Just now performing with her troupe somewhere near Oxenfurt. Her specialities. Rhythmic gymnastics. Type of one. Breaking and entering. Not officially, no, but I've compared the route her troops taken with a list of the most audacious thefts in recent years. A perfect match. Highly doubt that's a coincidence. But if she's reluctant, we've another option in Hugo Hoff, alias Beef Patty. A half -up. Think he's fit? Pudgy face. Doesn't really match my image of a crimp. You'd be surprised. 
Hugo's notched up more break-ins than you felled monsters. More importantly, two years past, he nicked the gold-plated cop from the roof of the town all in overcraft. So, the half man. Word has it, he's holed up in Oxenfurt, in a house near the Novagrand Gate. Be careful. He's modest in size, but apparently wicked dangerous. Alright, opening the vault. Who do we have? Let's start with the fact that one of them's a dwarf. Casimir Bassi, native of Mahakam. A specialist in controlled explosions. Folks say he could blow Novograd to the high heavens with but a pinch of saltpeter. Bold door for him should be a cinch. The problem is, Casimir apparently hung up his detonators some time ago. He married, sired some little ones, and settled in the village of Almas. My plane turned us down. Any options? Quinto, the North's most famed safe cracker. Arrest warrants out on him in Kedwin, Lyria, Angrin, and Kavir. Sadly, he got nabbed a few days back by one Hans of Sidaris, a prick mercenary. As far as I know, his troops made camp east of Oxenfurt on the right bank of the Pontar. <sighs> so I'd have to rip one from his cozy home, the other from a cozy cage. Need to think about it. What's this about culling the patrols? Told you, no one dies. Easy. I don't want anyone's death. Just need some folk to be temporarily indisposed. Spit it out. You've got to approach the garrison's cook. Convince him to spite the soldier's nosh with something to keep some of them bedridden. One in two, I say. Don't want to raise suspicion. Hmm. Know the formula for a potion that might do the trick. Then, see? Brew up a bit of that. Hit the town, find the cook, then convince him to do you a favor. I don't know, cast a spell, toss him some coin. You could also use your fists. All right, I'm off. Got a bit to do. As do I. Get it all done, and we'll meet back here. What then? Then, we'll bug a horse up, down, and sideways. All together. Quinto. The one and only. A pleasure. But who might you be? Whoa! I'll have no pleasure here. Witcher, keep clear of the cage. Right? I need Quinto. Alive. And I need coin. Lots of it. Lucky thing I don't much care who pays me. You or the bankers. Meaning Master Hands of Sidaris' moral spine is rather bendy. You'll be the one with the bendy spine in a minute. I said, shut your mouth. Where was I? Right. Want me to let him go? Pay up. Same as the wanted posters say. Han, 
hands. To claim that reward, you've got to deliver Quinto to the right hands. Seems a complication. Time's a consideration, and we all know time is coin. Shut it. What's your point, Witcher? Bankers are far away, whereas I'm here, saving you a lot of trouble. Think you should drop the price? Hmm. By how much? <laughs> You've got to be mad! Quite the reasonable offer to my mind. Your mouth. No, I've no patience for your kind. Full price and not a copper less. Overdid it a bit, Witcher. Even I'm willing to admit that. Aye, see? And you, keep your mouth shut. <sighs> Call it my loss. Here. Ah, nothing quite like the weight of a purse full of gold. Right, Quinto. You're dumb as shite, but look here's... What? How did you? Fishbone. Did it yesterday. I was waiting for a lull to slip out. Witcher showed up before I could. Let that be my recommendation. Now, do tell. What's it you need me for? Need you to open something for me. Something bigger than a cage. Sounds interesting. Dying to hear the details. Herbalist's hut near Oxenford. Knock on the door. Ask for yarrow extract. trouble, you make me responsible for getting us out. As in Maribor. Remember Maribor? Dove, please don't change the subject. Mind if I do? That depends. Who might you be? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. You Eveline Gallo? The Ermine? Only to friends. Calm down, Merrin. No need to puff up. And you? Talk. What do you want? Rather talk eye to eye. Everline conceals nothing from me, and... And you were to help set up the benches. Immediately. Uh, but... Very well. Once again, what do you want? Got a job for you. Truly? Of what nature? Hmm. Anonymous performance. No audience. At a certain... Auction house. Pays as much as you can carry. Hmm. You've none of a Fink's features. But you see, I've a problem.
All right, out with it. What's this problem? See, we were to do a show. The tickets have all sold. Alas, our friend and colleague, Hawkeye Van, well, he's gone blind. Drank some hooch from a questionable source. A sad story, but not the point. The crowd awaits, so either we find a replacement for him, or we shall have to return the coin. All good and fine, but we're not spent it already. Ah, I think I know where this is going. Then I shall get straight to the point. Stand in for Van, and I shall help you. What do I have to do? Jump through some flaming hoops? No. Shoot your crossbow, hit a target. Not a bad shot with my crossbow. Why not? I'm in. Splendid. So, shall we begin? Folk have grown nervous. What? Me now? No rehearsals? What's that to rehearse? You're to shoot and hit a target. All right. Do or die. Let's begin. That I like. A man who boldly dares damn the risks. Come! And now, good folk, the highlight of our program. Standing before you, Geralt of Rivia, victor of markmanship contest in Angren, Dol Blathana, and Lobinden. Wow, Troy! What? But I... Shh, Geralt. Grab your crossbow and get to work. Audacious feat by Geralt of Rivia. We thank you for attending and hope to see you soon. It's a shame that man didn't shoot the elf. That would have been brilliant. You know, I doubted I'd emerge from that ordeal in one piece. Fine work, Geralt. Well, one performance down. What of the next? Herbalist has a hut near here. Ring a bell? Go see him and ask for some yarrow extract. Ooh, a mystery. I adore mysteries. Till later, Witcher. Let me have a look. So long.
What do you have to say? Lance Corporal Vatslav. How'd that prick wind up with us? Volunteered. Word is he had to bribe the medics to let him enlist. He mad or what? That's just it. Certifiably insane. Didn't pass the tests apparently. But to pay hard coin to enter the army. Thought at my age nothing could surprise me. Nothing about the cook. What do you have to say? That uh, horse score solely. You got a daughter? Why do you ask? Well, think on it. To marry into a dynasty like that, it'd be like living in clover. Trust me, you do better not to take any interest in the Basodis. Why the hell not? It can only bring trouble, mate. Only trouble. Hmm, nothing interesting. What do you have to say? Fish chowder for supper today. Not true. Who told you? No one. Came through the western gate the morning. Saw Martin on the pier, rod in hand, fishing. Cook like that's the right treasure he is. No griping about puss. Nah. Nah. Aye. Nah. Aye. If only he go. Only you go oh. a bit lighter on the guard. In a hurry. Pier near the western gate. Should be easy enough to find. Must be the cook. Good day. Fish biting? Aye, they're biting. What about you? What's that? Got this mixture. Pay you to pour it in the soup for the boys of the garrison, on my signal. Nothing dangerous about it. Most they'll think is that the fish wasn't exactly fresh. It'll cost you, mate. Something dear. Asking a lot. Too much. How about you do this free of charge, huh? Out of the kindness of your heart. Aye. I'll help. Out of kindness. Wait for the signal. And mum's the word. Understood? <laughs> 